Hey everyone, it's me, Juan Luna, and today I'm going to be showing you how to clean your AirPods. Look at those. Look at how, oh, look how dirty that is. Oh my god. Alright, let's clean them. So, this clean will help you if you start losing hearing on your AirPods. Like, if you start losing, like, it's one sounds lower than the other one. This is what you have to do. So, AirPods, you can use water or this thing here called hydrogen peroxide. Um... You could use water, but water, since these have batteries in them, it, alcohol usually is the best way. So, let me put my camera up here, and let me show you what you're going to do. So, very simply, you're just going to pop this thing open here. Get some on your hand, your palm most likely. There you go. And you're going to get your Q-tip, and here I have it on my hand. It's dripping, it doesn't matter. Um, and you're just going to kind of spin it in there. Make sure the Q-tip kind of gets a little bit moist. Not too much. It doesn't really matter. All right. Don't make it too wet either. Um, it's barely moist. It won't damage anything. It's alcohol, so it won't really do anything. And all you're going to do is... I'm going to try to get close here. And you can see there. You can see the little things. And we're just going to do this real quick. See that gun? I don't know if you can see it. It's very minimal. These, ha these aren't that dirty. But eventually they will get dirty because it's pretty much the da same damn exact design um which i hate apple because they don't change it they don't change the design but here we are purchasing their products i don't know if you can very see the flash is kind of you know not working well with it because it's like uh, there you go it's mostly clean and this actually helps if you want to clean them you can actually kind of go around them and remove that those stains because alcohol won't do anything to them now we're just going to grab the other one Grab alcohol or water, whatever you prefer to use. If you do use water, be, you use very small amounts. All right, here we got some in my hand. It's dripping off. I don't really don't care. It's alcohol. Nothing happens. So you can see here, this one's way more wet. Uh, you can barely see it. There you go. It's way more wet. So what you want to do is just kind of rinse it off on your hand. If you if you have like a lot of residue, like <laughs> look, look, my fingers are very wet. That's not good. We should have very little residue because that all that's gonna go in there. And ultimately, even if it, it is alcohol. You don't want that to go. So just kind of swab it on your fingers. There you go. There you go. Should be good. So which one did I clean? God damn it. Should be the dirtier one. It's this one. So now we're just going to go in. You could use the other side if you wanted to, but mm, to be a little more cleanse, cleanseful, uh, we're using new one. And there you go. I've heard people use dish soap. Never do use dish soap. It's... Disgusting unless you want to clean just the outside, but even then these are airpods. These are not You can just clean these little grills out here You know whatever you want um, There you go You got yourself and you can also use this trick for Apple's earbuds as well. So There you go. They're brand new and clean and they should work perfectly fine unless something's actually wrong with them And I can just slap them back into my case Now to also clean the case if you really want to you can also just use these on swabs clean them off They're a little harder though um actually need more alcohol most likely yeah i need way more alcohol here to clean this these things because they look disgusting after a while and i don't like it personally so yeah i'm gonna clean those off later but yeah there you go um you can also use like i said water but uh, i recommend you just using hydrogen peroxide or alcohol to get the job done so uh there you go thank you guys so much for watching hopefully this helps and I'll talk to you all later.